Takatobi Radio, your one-stop source for all convention, anime, and video game news. Now for your hosts, Zenis and Blue. Thanks again for joining us on Takatobi Radio. I'm Zenis. And I'm True Blue, but you can just call me Blue. So, Blue, how was your weekend? Boring. How about yours? Awesome. Just awesome. Yeah, terrific. Yeah. You smell all girly. Well, I hope so, seeing that I'm a girl. And I'm a manly man. Right, so maybe we should focus on the actual show now. Alright, alright. We've got several topics we'll be covering. What topics might those be? Well, uh, stay tuned to find out. Ooh, yes, that's a teaser, yeah. I don't recall this show being German. Well, it could be. <sighs> Tsubasa-Con, West Virginia's premier anime convention and Japanese culture festival, will be returning to the Huntington Riverfront Ballroom and Conference Center on October 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. Pre-registration for Tsubasa-Con is now open, and for a limited time, you can get your three-day pass for only $30 through April 30th. To pre-register for this exciting event, or for more information about the convention, please visit tsubasacon.org. We've got a few big anime names coming out on April 6th. Naruto Shippuden Volume 8 will be one of those coming out on that date, containing episodes 31 through 34. This volume brings the end to one arc and begins another. Thankfully, like all of its previous DVD releases, it will be uncut. Yeah, I caught Naruto Shippuden on Disney XD a couple of times, and I'm still questioning whoever made that decision. I mean... They cut out Sasuke's sword in the first episode. His sword! Are you kidding me? I mean, why would they... What did they do to cut it out? Uh, okay, okay. See, in the first episode, like, within, like, the first two minutes of it, Sasuke pulls out his sword to cut someone. They cut out him even pulling out the sword. Like, it's never even there. Wow. That's pretty lame. But you know what isn't? <laughs> Code Geass. I love Lelouch. And he's voiced by Johnny on Bosch. Oh boy. Kogia Lelouch of the Rebellion R2 Part 4 will be out also on April the 6th, in which there will be both a normal and limited edition. Yes! Yeah, that, that is supposed to contain the final six episodes of the series, right? Yep, it will finish up its DVD release. Truly sad to see it finished, but a great series and I highly recommend it. Oh, and I believe there's more Gundam on the way, right, Blue? Yes, there is! Gundam 00 Season 2 Part 1. Picking up where Season 1 left off, which was four years after the original Armed Interventions by Celestial Bean. Uh, Zenith is eventually going to watch the series, so I'd rather not give too much away. Yeah, I'm being a real slacker right now. I've been really, really busy working on cosplay lately. Shh! It's a secret! Yeah, it's really nice of you, Blue, not to give it away as a spoiler. No one likes spoilers. SPOILERS! <laughs> <laughs> uh, considering the first episode of Trigun you showed me was the last episode, yeah, I'd say it is nice of me. <laughs> yeah, moving on quickly. A couple of items that are releasing on Blu-ray. One of them is Trinity Blood, the complete series. That will grant your wish on March 23rd. Also coming out for both DVD and Blu-ray is Auron High School Host Club, the complete series. Look for it to hit store shelves on March 30th. This is Jay Lee Bly, convention operator at SubasaCon, and here's a look at our current guest list. Gina Biggs, creator of the online graphic novel Red String and the website Strawberry Comics, will be returning for her second year. Musical guests, The Extraordinary Contraptions, will be providing their unique blend of steampunk rock for your listening pleasure. Jen Lee Quick, author of the comic Renaissance and OEL manga Offbeat, will be returning for her fourth year. For additional details about our guests, please visit our website at subasacon.org. All right, fans, my turn to pick a song of the week. This is Monstrous Turtles from Super Mario World by Zircon. 
This is an awesome remix of the castle theme and map 5, Forest of Illusion. And that was Monstrous Turtles by Zircon. You can find this song and more at www.ocremex.org.